Hello and welcome to Tutor Pipes Tutorials for Skype. In this tutorial we're going to go over how to set up your microphone so you can uh, make your first test call. This tutorial assumes that you already have Skype installed and uh, uh, everything is in good working order. So by the end you should have intermediate knowledge with how to test your microphone as well as test your audio playback. Testing your audio um, input and your output is extremely easy, especially with, uh, with Skype. The first thing that you see whenever you open Skype up for the first time, this is at directly after you have installed Skype onto your, uh, your PC or your laptop, what, whatever, is this right here. Okay. Now this is our Skype test call. And basically what we can use this for is to test our sound. All right, and what we want to do is just click the phone icon directly to the right of our little test character, or we can just go ahead and click on the phone icon down at the bottom. Okay, you can see that it's trying to connect now. Okay, I'm hearing something now. Now it's asking me to record. So I'm recording something. I believe it's eight seconds long. Okay. And now it's playing back the sound in my ear. Okay. Now, if everything goes according to plan, uh, you should be able to hear Skype's testing service, and then you should be able to record your own voice, and then it plays it back for you. And if everything is working properly, then you should go through... Uh, the uh, the it's about a three-step process fairly easily and you should be all set to go that means that everything is in good working order including uh, your hardware not just your software meaning your microphones and your speakers whether you have a headset or whether you have just a microphone and regular speakers um, or uh, PC speakers it doesn't really matter it still works the exact same way Okay, now let's just say, for example, that for some reason it does not work. Um, either the audio in your speakers are off or the, uh, the audio capture, meaning your microphone, is not recording uh, your voice. First and foremost, you want to make sure that your speakers are on. Okay, so in order to do that, what you want to do is test a sound, any sound file that you have on your PC. Okay, whether it's something that you've downloaded from the, inter uh, the internet or it's something in a sounds folder that you have set up in My Documents. Uh, music is a good thing that you can test out too. Okay? The first thing that we want to make sure of is that we're going to be able to hear uh, whatever has been recorded. Okay? If our microphone is working, it doesn't really matter because we're not going to be able to hear what we've recorded so we won't know that our microphone is working. Okay, so first step process if uh, uh, something goes wrong is to test your speakers. Okay, so the first thing that you want to do is you want to adjust the volume on the speakers itself. Make sure that the volume is all the way up. And if that is not the case, then what you want to do is if you have a um, what looks like a volume control and normally um, you know everybody knows what their volume control is in the uh, in the little tray icon in the lower left hand or excuse me lower right hand side of your monitor okay um, another way is to open up your control panel by clicking start and then control panel and then this is the window that uh, that comes up right here okay we can double click on sounds and audio devices okay and you can see that if that um, icon isn't there at the lower right hand s in our tray um, in our disk tray we can just go ahead and check this box right here and the volume will appear or the volume icon will appear okay now once we have our sounds and audio device properties uh, box or dialog box open what we can do is click on voice the voice tab and then we can just go ahead and click on test hardware All right, our sound hardware test wizard 
appears. Okay, and what it does is it locates the sound card on all the sound software as well as the audio software to pick up your, uh, your microphone's sounds. Okay, so based on everything that you have in there, it may take, uh, you know, a minute or two. And once it is complete, the first thing that we're going to see is a little um, testing area for our microphone. Okay, and whenever we speak into our microphone, we should be able to hear, or I'm sorry, we, sh we should be able to uh, see the voice bar go up and down. Okay, such it is as it is right now. Okay, so if this is, this should be working if considering that you have your microphone plugged into the correct port, uh, either on the front or the back of your computer. Okay, make, always make sure that it's pushed in all the way. It usually should click as soon as you, uh, as soon as you push it in properly. Okay, but it will auto adjust based on the the amount of loudness in your voice. Okay, and then once we are done with that, we just go ahead and click next, and then it moves back to or it moves to our playback. Okay, and now as I'm speaking into the microphone, you should be able to hear. Uh, with a little bit of a delay, w exactly what you are saying. Okay, whether it's through your earpieces or your PC speakers, that shouldn't matter. You should be able to hear something. Okay, we can adjust the volume right here. All right. So once everything is set, we click next and then click finish. Click OK, and you should be all set to go. Okay. So remember, first and foremost, whenever you're uh, troubleshooting I, your microphone and your speakers, always make sure that the hardware is in properly. In other words, it's connected to the, uh, to the proper port and it's pushed in all the way. And make sure that the volume on your speakers is all the way up. Okay? If that doesn't work, then go into the software side where you can um, open up your control panel and try adjusting the settings of the microphone or of the speaker volume itself. Okay, so that is how you set up your microphone and your speakers, uh, as well as test call. By now, you should have intermediate knowledge with uh, using Skype to test your speakers and um, uh, microphone, as well as uh, troubleshooting your microphone and speakers. All right, so thank you very much for watching Tutor Pipes Tutorials.